Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's Nick Snowell here, and we're back with another video. We're back with Nikki Reacts, and for today's video, we're gonna be reacting to Haunted Five because why not? Five scary ghost videos you probably can't handle, so let's you know see if you can handle some scary stuff. Yeah. And if you guys haven't yet, please do subscribe and click that little bell right next to it. Take a look, make it last. Well, it'll help a girl out. If you guys haven't seen my last video, click on the moon, click on the ghost, click on the screen, because why not? And in this video, we're going to be commenting, suggesting, and we're going to figure out if these videos are fake or not. And yeah, let's get into watching to see if you can handle some scary stuff. A family was throwing a birthday party birthday for one party. of its members when something took place that shocked everyone in attendance. Was everyone alive. that was present, from children to grandparents, were having an incredible time and decided to record the birthday girl blowing out the candles on her cake. The family was singing her a birthday song, but once it concluded, she was ready to blow out the candles when something occurred that left the family unnerved. And it's on the, on the birthday. <laughs> Two. Oh my god, she's making the wish. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of millions in this guy. What the heck? Who's that? Who blew it out? Who? It has to be one of them. It has to be one of the family members. It was a win. Mi abuelita. What win? It's not fucking. There's no win. Who blew it out? 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 Who blew it as the birthday girl finishes making her wish, the candles are mysteriously blown out with no obvious explanation. Nobody can be seen blowing them out, and the birthday girl even looks behind her to see if someone was there, but was know, shocked was to like see no really one. Glow, one of the family right? members mentioned Oof, it may be the grandma like who passed away recently. Paranormal or not, the family was genuinely stunned. Grandma was like, hurry up and blow out your candle, girl. A few friends were driving home late one evening when they noticed something mysterious on the left on the side of the road. Okay. The specific road they road were driving cats. down is rumored to be cursed, and few people in the community use the road after sundown. They didn't think much of the rumors regarding the road and were certain it was a superstitious tale. Okay. Everything seemed rather ordinary in the beginning, but soon their peaceful ride would turn into a nightmarish experience. She was on full on dress. Yo, that is clear as day. Yeah, heck no. Just moments into the video, you can hear the panic in the man's voice yeah, as they genuine. notice a figure standing on the left side of the road. Absolutely as they genuine. approach the figure, they notice a long white dress, along with the head completely missing. That was clear as they day, don't make bro. any attempt to stop and see if she's okay, which makes complete sense given the circumstances. Yeah, you don't want to stop. Did for they a girl capture a headless apparition, dress or is there a more reasonable explanation? Mm -mm. A family lives in a 300-year-old house and has reportedly experienced strange activity since they moved in. The most common occurrences have been objects moved around the house, along with mysterious disembodied voices heard in various rooms. The family grew up around the paranormal, so although the events can be uncomfortable at times, they don't freak out when it does happen. Okay. One evening, one of the young girls right. was doing her homework at the dinner table when the unexpected took Lord place. Videos. Yeah. I saw this one. This was pretty much out of the blue too, like poltergeist activity. Chair pulling out. Yup. The chair. 
Yeah, she was like, eh. As the father turns off the girl lights and heads upstairs, the young girl today, is focused sister. on doing her homework. After a few moments, the chair to her right is Not moved today. away from the table entirely on its own. A few seconds after, the chair to her left seems to fall over completely by itself. She calmly gets up from the table and heads out of the room. So if this didn't panic. scare the family, what they experienced a few days later definitely would. People in the house. No one else here. I'm gonna stay here. Huh? I'm gonna stay here. Stay here. Right. I didn't come from this area in the house, but it sounds like footsteps. Yeah, I don't want you in that room, bro. Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. The door mm -hmm. just closed. Was there someone in? Did you see anyone? There was no one in there, girl. Be careful. Mm -hmm. Guys, is there anyone in here? I mean, if they answer, yeah, then the door. you've got an answer. There's no one in here. As the father makes his way upstairs to investigate the loud footsteps, he checks the bathroom but sees nobody in there. Once he confirms the bedroom also has nobody present, he pans his camera down the dark hallway and notices the far bedroom door slamming completely on its own. When he goes to investigate, he doesn't see anyone nearby. Paranormal or not, the family was genuinely stunned. Yeah. A woman was home alone late one evening and noticed her cat acting very strange. Ever since her and her boyfriend moved in, they began to experience mysterious activity. As they searched the internet for possible answers, they may have discovered the source of the paranormal events. They found out that one of the previous owners murdered his family with a hammer. As if the history of the property wasn't creepy enough, she decided to record her cat for her boyfriend and captured something far more disturbing. Just moments into the footage, we can see her cat looking up towards the ceiling. Oh, wait, that's not one Just of behind the couch, we can see a dark shadow figure walking from right to left. Oh, she wasn't supposed Many to people in the eyes. comments section are convinced she captured paranormal activity, yeah. possibly one of the victims from the fatal murders. The oh skeptics, on the other oh, hand, okay. are certain oh, it was a friend or family member walking out of the room. The man behind the popular YouTube channel Midwest Ghost Hunter yeah, decided to investigate an abandoned sanatorium. The building was built in 1905 and functioned as a tuberculosis hospital until its closure in 1943. Unfortunately, many people that entered the building for treatment saw their final days within these walls. Oh, the building is rumored to be haunted by the former not patients. Nice. It's not pretty. It wasn't long into his investigation when he encountered the following. I'm gonna sit down here. I've got a K2 meter here. I'm gonna see if I can communicate with anyone who's in here. If there's any spirits in here, I'd like to communicate. Where'd you capture it? Got a device right here. Where'd you capture it, bro? It has a green light. It will not hurt you. It's completely safe. All you have to do is touch it or move by it, and it'll detect your presence. Is there a spirit in here with me right now? Because I heard some noises coming from this room. If you are in here with me, could you touch that green light? Green light. Yes. Thank you. Are you a patient here? Okay, it's yes. answering through your K2. Okay. What were you sick with? Was it tuberculosis? It's gonna answer. Yes. I am so sorry to hear that. Are there other spirits here? How many are there? How many are there? That How many are there? That was so loud. Whoa, I just heard that. Yeah, that was shocking, bro. 
That's so loud. I don't know what that was. That scared me. That was pretty loud. As he enters the sanatorium, he begins to hear loud noises coming from one of the nearby rooms. As he enters, he begins to feel a presence nearby and decides to use his K2 meter to communicate with them. As he asks simple questions to they the spirit, answer. they offer him intelligent responses by interacting with the K2 meter. Not long after he concludes the session, a disembodied breath can be heard nearby. As if this wasn't creepy enough, what he encountered next sent chills down his spine. What else besides the breath? Okay, still photos. More still photos. There will not be anything popping up, bro. Hello? Thought I may have heard somebody down here. Yeah, there's a miss. Oh, gosh. Whoa, I got something weird on this Hold camera. On. I tried to get it again. No, no. That was just one time. That was just one time. Whoa, what the heck was that? That was just one time. Dude! It was like a full-on mist. It's like a straight-up mist figure. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Here. Hundo. Who's in this room? Hello? It was like right in this doorway. And it's gone! He's like so he's like so happy to capture that. I feel like genuine happiness. Hello? <gasps> Whoa. Felt sounds like chain, chain. Who's over here? Or like metal clanking. I'm seeing stuff and hearing stuff in here. <gasps> Whoa! Holy dude! A freaking mist just went right in front of me. I did not see that. It went right out that door. I gotta follow it. Oh. He's like, uh, I gotta follow that mist. That mist figure literally just went right in front of me. Holy shit. How are you not so scared? It was not this way. It's like, I didn't see it. Where'd you run off to? Heck, heck, heck no. Nah, uh back there. Not today, sister. It must have went this way. Are you over here? <gasps> yeah, it's communicating with you. Oh because you're so invested, you're so interested. Mm -hmm. Maybe we're Someone's the interested this whole way. in me. Are you down there? On. I mean, that can't be edited, right? It looks... <sighs> As he investigates the sanatorium further, he begins to take photos of various rooms to see if he can capture some paranormal evidence that way. Surprisingly, he captures a white translucent apparition in one of oh, the doorways. He so jolly when he saw As he that. enters the room to see if he can spot the entity, he begins to hear loud banging noises followed by the mist flowing right in front he of him. So jolly when he Once he that, goes like, after the figure, mist. he hears a loud bang at you. the end of the hallway, followed by the apparition moving from left to right. Did he capture a former patient in the haunted sanatorium, or is there a more rational explanation? He might have, he might have. Oh my gosh, Haunted 5. That was five scary ghost videos you probably can't handle. But then, I, I myself knew that I handled those pretty well. I've seen one of the video actually that was on Lord Darkness's uh, channel, so yeah. Any who's in, Haunted 5, Haunted 5 never fails, and guys, go check out Haunted 5 because he's got some banger videos, mint. Anyway, if you guys haven't yet, please do subscribe, click that notification bell so you're notified every time I post a brand new video. Follow me on Instagram, both my Instagrams, and yeah. I'll see you guys in my next video. Spooky season. Spooky season all year round.